KD has really taken on that defensive mentality. We yeah. saw it again uh, late in this game, and the rest of the team followed yeah. suit. So I, I've been I've been seeing this team play better defense, and it's not a mirage. Hey, McCoy. Hey, McCoy. Defensively, they locked in. They got a, a couple big steals at the end of this game. Book got one of them yep. that really closed this out and sealed the deal. And like, that, I think, is worth yeah. at least giving a little love to. There was about a three-minute stretch there where neither team could <laughs> yeah. score. Yeah. Um, but the Suns, what I did like about it was, you know, I think it was Miles Turner got the ball down on the block, and you just knew, like, hey, you got to send help. You got to send help. Yeah. And they went, oh, I'm sorry. It was Siakam. It was Siakam down low on the block. Yes. Was guarding yes. 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 And, uh, and then they, uh, Grayson Somebody, came over Grayson. to help and then forced them into a bad shot, which I thought was terrific. Like, they, they adjusted on the fly, which I really liked. Um, Grayson continues to show that he's a solid defensive player. Um, you know, it, Grace, Grayson is not the greatest one on one defensive player, but he's his intangibles yes. are next level. Yes. And that's what keeps him in the game. That's what keeps him playing at a high level. He does these small little things that help. If he gets beat, he already knows, okay, if I get beat and I got help, I yeah. need to go over here go to the in. corner yeah. just in case they try to pass it out. Or, you know, small little things that he's reading. I, I just love that about Grayson. Um, overall, I was happy with the Suns defense. I mean, you got to give the Pacers credit, man. They, 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 they hit they, shot. They, they've never seen a bad shot. They've never seen a shot they didn't like. I, I'm and they a, just kept chucking and chucking and chucking, and they didn't stop. But the Suns weathered the storm right. and got through it. They had some terrible rotations early in this early, game. Early, yeah. you know, early. Even, even into the third quarter, but in that fourth, especially second half of that fourth, they locked down, held the Pacers to 44%, stopped three or four shots around the rim as well, which early in that game – it was it was free free going in the in the paint yeah. for the uh, for the Pacers, but I, they really locked down. And again, we talk about it in the pregame has really taken on that defensive mentality. We yeah. saw it again uh, late in this game, and the rest of the team followed yeah. suit. So I I've been I've been seeing this team play better defense, and it's not a mirage. No. They're getting better. They're getting significantly better, which is again why I told the under tonight. I, I completely felt like the Suns were going to put a good defensive effort against a team like this. Don't I'm, lie. In the first half, you were at halftime. You look at that score and you go, nah, "No, maybe I, I made the wrong call." I, was I ever nervous about the under? Did you feel that I was nervous? <laughs> I, I really never felt nervous. I, I, I mean, mean you were again, as nervous as Saul at the end of the game. <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, no, I will. I will say this: they're starting to get that identity on defense as well. A lot of scrappiness. I think to your point, Grayson is is showing that he is a heck of a team defender. Yeah. Like he really gets the principles on defense and he makes up a lot of people's errors. Mm -hmm. And in that first half you're talking about, a lot of the Indiana Pacer movement with Nurt getting stuck was causing confusions on the backside. Yeah. And they would just fly into the lane wide open. So Eddie made a point on a, on a telecast. He was like, you know what? In this particular game, Nurt being out maybe ain't bad. Because this this movement and pace didn't fit him well. They they were a lot better with Eubanks in the game, and a lot of those miscommunications weren't happening. And so they're they're getting it done on the defensive end. And then the last thing I'll say is their offense is some of their defense, man. They apply so much damn pressure on offense that you saw the paces today. They had some shots that I seen them make, but they looked exhausted too. They were like, man, these guys are going punch for punch with us. And so I like what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying about the identity. I'm starting to see it coming through.